So today we're going to take a look at two different Witcher collaboration units, Fire Siri and Dark Siri. Fire Siri we already kind of took a look at in the dungeon video, which she did not do very well. Even though the opponents, uh, she does damage based on the opponent's HP, her speed, and the enemy's max HP. Also, Dark One, well we didn't look at this one yet because for the most part it's a guild siege unit because the guild content leader skill and then the AoE strip. After that, I mean, you, you take this out in RTA and or in Arena or in wherever else and she really loses a lot of her value because half her value is in this and half her value is in this in my <clears throat> in my uh, in my opinion. So uh, I also don't know that this is as strong as a lot of the other options RTA wise. I feel like I would rather have. I would rather have so many units. I would rather have a Robo, for example. But Robo in Guild Siege does not have the Guild Siege, Guild Siege leader skill. We're going to take a look at her today. We're going to take a look at this today. This way we at least can say, hey, we did videos on them. Even though we kind of put her in another video. Uh, so she does increase crit rate if her crit rate is already maxed. She increases her crit damage. Does she do enough with the rest of these? We'll find out. All right. Everything else has to be super fast. I'm wondering if they banned the water puppeteer. They banned the Chi Wu. Bans the 33 spell. Okay, so left hand side's taking turn one. I'm going to call this already. Surprised that they went for that, but. Oh, hold on. Maybe I shouldn't have called it so fast. Okay, get some slows. And then big damage. Nice. I, I thought this was going to be a clean sweep in the other direction. <laughs> All right, so we got a lot of speed-based damage on the left hand side, and of course the Leo gets banned on the right. So I'll see, guard crush on on the Nana and increases attack age. I'm both surprised and <laughs> okay, yeah. I mean, you could have just let her. Stay in there. She wasn't really going to do too much, in my opinion. Yeah, well, she's really good at uh, at dying. But also, I was expecting the opponent to have uh, the other units faster than Sonya. I get that it's easier to make Sonya faster, but yeah, they kind of nerfed themselves there. Both teams trying to take turn one. Just kidding. What are they doing? All right, so this is this match is already over. Unless Savannah's on Swift and the opponent doesn't have will. No, wait, hold on. Is this going to be enough? Yeah, she didn't do really do too much. Okay. If she had a water pure vanilla with her, so so now this is over. Can I call this? It feels very over. Yeah. So I came back from Vanessa, not, uh, not itself. You guys know, you guys are paying attention. Both players trying to take turn. Oh, here's all the LDs. They got to pick a second speed lead on the right-hand side. They do. What gets banned? Tiana gets banned. Are they faster with this fire, Ken? They are. This was just a match of seeing who is the fastest. Okay. No, they don't even get the, the speed break. Okay. Let's see if that's going to be enough to kill. It is enough to kill. Although, this is going to be nasty now. Yeah, she's going to do almost zero damage. Okay, so it's a fire Ken spotlight. Got it. Okay, both players. Oh, are they going to be fast enough? This would be really nice to see. If they are super fast on the left-hand side and they ban the Ethna, they do not. Well, they ban the speed lead. Okay, good enough. Oh, she doesn't have anything to buffer. <laughs> yeah, this is a... Uh... This is a nat 4 versus a nat 5. So one of them is actually... Oh, uh, Rika was not even dead. They could have come back from that. All right. So both players very, very fast. Trying to take turn one. Who actually does? Yikes. Okay. They're still going to outspeed on the right-hand side. Yeah. Wow. Oh, and it's not even close. Okay. Well, this is just, <laughs> this is just a match of speed. Yeah, why'd they even go for that one? They didn't need to go. They could have just left her in there. Okay, maybe maybe I'm, I'm being too toxic already. The Minato comes out there. All right. Interesting. 
I know we're, we want to look at the unit, but oh, they, they just ruined it for themselves. Like just just picking her is is almost like that's that's that was the downfall of that team is they picked the fire zero the unit they were trying to see I'm not trying to be toxic she just could be a good place for her oh they don't have I mean it, they they need the one two combination of speed buff right and then the Martian needs to defense break they're just gonna go for it to Sarion. <laughs> Yeah, here we go. Look at that big damage. I, I I would love to see her win. I really would. Okay. <sighs> ah, my brain hurts, guys. My brain hurts. First pick fire monkey. Oh, now they're going for the cleave. How nasty can this get? I... <laughs> Okay, here's what I don't understand about what my, my reaction to that. I was like, oh, fire Siri, that's so dumb. And I'm like, that's why we're looking at it. We are looking to see what she can do. <laughs> that's the point of the video. Yeah, I think that this was just uh, one player knew more what they were doing than the other. That's That's, that's my takeaway from this. But let's see. Let's see if this can do some damage. Okay. She, she really does not do a whole lot of damage compared to some of the other things. Like, if you're going to bring a fire unit that does damage based on speed, or that, that does single target damage, like, would you rather have Masha? Because I'm just thinking, like, why would I use her over Masha? There's like 15 reasons why I would rather have Masha on the team. I mean, Masha's a five star, don't get me wrong, but it's not an RT unit. Let's see. There's, they both have a lot of losses on their record. It's, it's about two to one ratio of losses to wins. So I would not take these. I mean, we, we just want to see what these things can do. That's, that's mainly it. I, I wouldn't go crazy trying to bring these into, I mean, it might already be very obvious. Uh, watching this, you're like, yeah, I don't really want to bring these into RTA. The dark one's okay for guild siege defense, but um, not uh, or even guild siege offense. I, I shouldn't say just defense because the speed lead in the strips. So there's a lot that that can enable. Uh, but for for the rest of the content, I just I I don't feel like either of these really have as much value in anything else the dark one in guild siege absolutely and everything else she just once you lose that speed lead she doesn't have enough in her kit to justify it people are just gonna pick more efficient units they're gonna stop picking this as soon as they realize that her win rate is uh she's got like a both of you have like a 30 percent win rate it's not great anyway that's it for this one food for thought see who's always in the next one